Hi, this video was made by Salman Husseini and narrated by Nidufire Skandari from Hyperlyceum team. Today I'm gonna explain how to fix the problem during compilation error as well as the causes of this error. To start with, here is an example of the reported error. Abacus shows this error in a monitor section and usually doesn't give us any more details. There are three reasons why we face this error. The first reason is that Abacus is not linked with Fortran. To fix this error, I recommend you watch the video on how to link Abacus and Fortran on our website hyperlyceum.com. Also, to ensure that there's no problem in linking, I'll put the link for some executable files. By executing these files, you can check if the problem is due to the linking or the code you developed. For example, if you get an error by running these files, it means you didn't link your software properly. If not, it explains that there is an error in your code. The second reason causing this error is problems in written code, like putting a bracket or period when it's not needed, or typing an incomplete command. All these things can cause this error. And the last reason for this error is the incompatibility of the subroutine with the Abacus solver. For example, UMAT subroutines and USEFLD are compatible with the static general and dynamic implicit steps. Also, subroutines like VUMAT, VDLOAD, and VUSDFLD are compatible with the steps like explicit dynamic. These are very important as they may lead to creating the problem during compilation error. In this video, I'm going to show you some ways to detect the error and explain how it came up in the first place. This is the model that we're going to use in this example. And as you can see, there is a sheet and the DISP subroutine is used for displacement. I avoid giving you more details as they are not the purpose of this video. First, I'll show you the results obtained when executing the correct file and that the sheet is under a 6mm displacement in the direction of Z. And now here is the code. To start with an example, I can put a period right here and run it to create an error in the code. The first approach to find out where the error is coming from is opening the file with the log extension. As you can see, it shows that the error is coming from the period after the return command. So we understand that we need to omit it. There's also another way to check and troubleshoot this error. Here I'll make a new error and start debugging the code with another method. First, I copy the directory here, then open the abacus command. Here is a predefined directory that I need to change. I type cd and paste the directory of my files, then enter. Now a new directory is defined for us. I type abacus job and try to find the imp file using the top button. Job number 2, space and type user, then choose a subroutine using the tab option. The subroutine is now selected. The interactive command is to indicate the reasons for the errors. Enter. Here it explains that the reason for this error is because the word and diff is written and there's no if then or else statement for that. In our example, we have if command but there's no then as it's in the 10th line. By writing the word then, the error will be solved. Now I'll execute it again. As you can see, this time the model was completed with no problem and I can open the abacus and check the results. Thank you for watching this video and I hope you enjoyed it. Until the next one, bye! This video was made by Salman Husseini. To find his contact information and his updated resume, please visit our website, hyperlyceum.com. Salman is an expert in Abacus, Dreamatics, Mimics, SolidWorks, Ketia, 
and a few other engineering software. To plan online sessions and discuss industrial and academic projects, please use the provided email under Salman's contacts. The cost of the projects vary depending on the complexity of the work and can be discussed in advance. We look forward to working with you.